Hmm. <laughs> Rani, what happened? I did not want to come to school today. But why? Our street dog Chika was limping in the morning. Seems like he hurt his right foot. So? I wanted to help him. But how? Stop picking your nose. Okay, okay, but tell me na. Go away, please. I will bring our tiffins from the classroom. Yes, let's eat outside today. Rani, come let's have lunch. You yuck, the toilet is so dirty. Sonu, you did not flush after using the washroom? And you left the toilet seat dirty inside. There will be other children using the toilet after you. Show some good manners. Okay, sorry. I will flush next time after use for sure. Did you wash your hands? Now please don't start again, Rani. Sonu, you know that germs can enter our bodies through dirty hands and we can fall sick. Hygiene is very important. When will you understand? Fine. You have your lunch. I am going. Wow, Rani! Let's have pulled up. You go. I don't want to. Why? I am not sure if his hands are clean. But I really want to have pulled up. He is more hygienic and clean. Wow, I can smell something yummy. What are you cooking? Hmm, make a guess. Halva. Yes, right. Oh great! My mouth is already watering. Let me wash my hands. And yes, your papa took Chika to the doctor. He put a bandage on his leg. Oh thank God! Chika is fine. Yes. Now be quick to wash your hands. Rani is happy, but is her friend Sonu happy? Do you agree with Sonu? If you were in Sonu's place, what would you have done in the given situations? Why did Rani stop Sonu from picking his nose? Sonu left the toilet dirty. Have you ever come across a dirty toilet? How did you feel about it? Why do you think Sonu did not wash his hands? It may take a very little effort to maintain hygiene and cleanliness. <laughs>